how would you like it for one day or a week that we go into life and you'll see what it's like to be me and I will see what it's like to be you oh wouldn't it be weird to see what it's like to be you and you probably would think it's weird to see what it's like to be me but you see we'll learn something in the end how would you like it for one day or a week that we go into life and you'll see what it's like to be me and I will see what it's like to be you oh wouldn't it be weird to see what it's like to be you and you probably would think it's weird to see what it's like to be me but you see we'll learn something in the end how would you like it for one day or a week that we go into life and you This movie is basically about two boys who had nothing in common at all, but one day they changed places to see what it was like to be a hacker. David basically noticed Dennis going down a long, dark alleyway, and he followed him. The strange lady said, come closer, my children, come closer. The strange lady knew their name and said, hi, Dennis, hi, David. David and Dennis said, how did you know our name? The strange lady said, I know who you are. I know you're completely different and you hate each other. How would you like to change places? David and Dennis said, yeah, okay. Like, that's gonna happen. And the old lady gave them some cookies and they ate it. David basically arrived at his house and mom was there, but mom had something to tell him. David and Sarah's mom said to David, you've been invited to your best friend's aunt's wedding. Do you want to go? David said, when is it? David's mom said, it's a Saturday. David said, okay, I'll go. Dennis was at his house, and when he came to the door, he threw his coat on the floor. And his mom told him to pick it up. And then Dennis started swearing at his mom. And his mom sent him to his room. It was basically night time, and David and Dennis changed lives, and they end up in each other's body. When Dennis woke up, he noticed he was in a strange mood, so he figured that the lady was right. He changed places with David, so he decided he'll play along with him for now. Sarah said to David, get out, don't you want to watch cartoon with me? David said, don't you want? Sarah said, do I have to? Uh, David fought for a minute and said, okay, I'll watch cart cartoon with you. Sarah said, okay. David woke up, and he found himself in a strange room, so he figured it was Dennis's room because the lady was right, so he decided that he would play along with it. David and Sarah's mom told David, it's time for you to go to Holly and Wedding. David said, why would I want to go there? David and Sarah's mom said, you were invited, remember? And you said yes yesterday. David said, oh yeah, okay, I'll go. David was at the wedding and he was very bored, but finally the wedding was over and it was time for the party, so they went there at the party.
Meanwhile, at Dennis's house, Dennis's little brother wanted to show him something, and you know what it was? It was fireworks. Dennis said, I don't think you're supposed to be playing with fireworks. They're very dangerous. Chris said, you sound like a sissy. Peter showed up and said, you guys are not supposed to be playing fireworks? And guess what? I called the call. And they're going to take your mom away for allowing you to play fireworks. Dennis said to his mom, I'll try anything possible to get you out of jail. I know it was a firework. I know it was something else, but you don't know. You don't want to tell me. I understand. Dennis and Chris's mom said to Chris, Don't worry. They'll finally get me out of jail. So Chris went up to the police officer and said, Can I hear the siren? And the police officer said, Sir. And then Chris jumped up and down like an idiot, saying, Wee, 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 wee. At the party for Holly and wedding, they had a free course meal for dinner and the food was absolutely delicious. CW said to David, who do you like better, me or Holly? David said, I like you equally. CW said, why is it there were only two girls in the entire world and you had to be one of their boyfriends? Who would you choose? And David said, I'll choose CW. And then CW said, you would? Do you want to dance with me? And then David said, yeah, I do want to dance with you. Dream, dream, dream. Dream, 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 whenever I want you, all I have to do is dream. Dream, 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 dream. But see, when I'm dreaming my life away, kiss your lips are fine sometimes. Whenever I want you, all I have to do is dream. David said to Holly, guess what, CW is my girlfriend now. Holly was upset at David, so, he, so she ran away. Holly was very upset, so she thought if she started singing, it would cheer her up better, so she did. I knew the thing would barely come and I stand by the door. I don't understand, but I knew it barely would happen that he told her over me. As I stand here, I am very upset. See, yo, you said to Holly, I'm sorry what happened. Holly said, I knew he would have to choose one of us one of these days. See, well, you said, yeah, Holly, come on into the party. The party's still going on. Come on, Holly. Holly said, yeah, I'll come into the party. The wedding party was basically over, and the guests went home. David said, what are you doing here, Dennis? Dennis said, what are you doing here? David said, I want my own body back. David said, I want my own body back too. David and Dennis said, we want our life back and we will be back in our own body. So the lady said, first of all, I'll give you back your life and allow you to be in your own body if you tell me what you have learned. Dennis, who was in David's body, said, I learned something so far. That having a friend and a girl is not the same thing as having a girlfriend. That is what I learned. David, who was in Dennis's body, learned that Dennis's little brother is an idiot. And Dennis said, it took you now to figure that out? David said, yeah. The lady said, I could see you learned something so far. So what she did is she clapped her hands. And David and Dennis were back in their own body. How would you like a gift for one day? Or a week that we go and change life? And you'll see what it's like to be me. And I will see what it's like to be you. Oh, 
wouldn't it be weird to see what it's like to be you?